Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you could add some illustrated characters to your PowerPoint presentations and you could kind of pick different poses and hairstyles and skin colors and outfits and that kind of thing. So if you, you know, if you have a need for that kind of thing in your presentations rather than having to go online and find some clip art or, you know, draw something yourself, you could use these. It's called Pixton Comic Characters and it's from Microsoft. You could get it from their App Source website. I'll put a link in the description. So once you're at the appropriate page here, just click on Get It Now. And just check the box that says I give permission to blah, blah, blah. And click on Continue. Okay, so now when it's installed here, you could click Open in PowerPoint and have it open PowerPoint for you. And so it'll automatically give you this home page here with some details about it and then it's going to say that's a new add-in so you want to tr trust this add-in and now it's going to be up here in the list and like I said you know description and so on so we're going to just insert a new slide here let's get rid of the text here so now when you click on Pixton characters you have a get started screen which we don't care about so you could start by picking your overall type if you want a you know, man woman child Let's pick this guy, and then you could say, you know, pick the skin color. Yeah, a lot of choices there. And then you can pick what kind of hair you want. Let's give this guy a beard. And then if you want to pick a certain outfit, let's make him an astronaut. And then here's all the poses you could choose from, you know, kind of relay what you're kind of feeling right now. So this guy's happy, so let's pick him. And then it'll, it'll place it in there. So once you have it in there, you know, you can move it around. You could resize it. You could even do some picture formatting on it. So let's say you want to, you know, add a shadow effect or even give them a nice glow, give them a nice yellow glow there type of thing and, you know, change the edges and artistic effects and so on. You know, just like you could within a picture. And you could even, you know, Flip it around the other way if you want, that kind of thing. Yeah, and then once you're done, you could go back and yeah, click on the group and yeah, pick someone else if you want. Just go through the process and add as many characters as you want. And, yeah, and then you could add your text and whatever else and, and you're good to go. It's pretty simple to use, so like I said, you don't have to look for clip art or go online searching for Google images or draw on your own. You could just install this little add in here and and do your thing. And if you don't want it anymore, you could right click on this group here and click remove and it'll take it out of PowerPoint and you won't have it there anymore. All right. So like I said, I'll put a link in the description and try it out and see how it works for you. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.